Hi, it's Bridget. This is a follow-up video. Just I'm going to have conversation here. I have a guest that um, watched the transformative channel with Prince today, and my husband surprised us with a guitar that I didn't I didn't know was coming into the session. And so we're just going to have a chat, so you guys can watch us talk about it or listen to us talk about it. I just want to die. Um, I just want to get it on recording. So, so what did you think? What was interesting about that I didn't think uh, Fender Strat was a guitar that Prince played I at don't all. I don't know anything about it so and I don't I, know guitar stuff so but then I as you were oh, doing your thing I'm seeing I did a picture a, right now. I looked I was looking on the internet I can see that and found a picture of him playing his um, we're in the office a baby, baby blue oh. Strat at the Super Bowl I can see that Pretty. So I was that surprised me. I didn't know that he had a strat. And, and I mean, yeah. later later on, he must use something different because when he was holding it, it felt weird. It didn't feel quite right. It was either too wide or too heavy or something. Or maybe it's because well, I wasn't standing. It wasn't tipped because he kept wanting to like uh, just like probably, and he kept touching it like I could feel wanting to be in my heart chakra and wanting to be in my solar plexus like really tight to my body. I'm looking at pictures now. My husband's pulled well, some up. Well, he has so. that custom purple one that, that was made for him with the mm. gold on it. He may have been... That one might it. actually be... Is that one of the ones that's on display at Paisley Park? Lynn, do you remember? Do you know? I know she she went on the ultimate tour, the big three-hour tour. <sighs> and uh, we'll get a good island for you there. Um... This is the cloud. Did you touch it? What he was okay, because he said I remember hearing cloud. I know he said cloud. He was right. he was trying to. He said he had a preference. He was feeling into that's, something else. It was is it thinner? Because I felt like it was thinner. Yeah. yeah, that's what it felt like. Because he kept touching it, and it was like it's not quite right. But oh, I really appreciate the gesture. Is how he felt. Like he really like we could have just sat for an hour just him holding a guitar. He would have loved it. It'd have been a little weird and not very good entertainment value, but really good. Wow. It's pretty cool. What I liked about this too is I bought this guitar in like 73 or so. That's the year I was born. And uh, <laughs> <laughs> Or so he said. <clears throat> so it could have been later. <laughs> now everybody knows how old I am. <laughs> Prince, and I, Prince and I are the same age. And so this is probably around the So I could have married Prince. Are you jealous? I'm just kidding. Probably around the we same, could have been twins. same time that he got his first guitar, too. It could be. I mean. I don't know. Maybe. So. My, yeah, it might have been. Oh, that's pretty sweet. Yeah, because you guys are the same age. 14. He would have been 14. Wow. And then you brought Tom Petty in. Tom Petty came in. Yeah, that was interesting. I did not expect oh. that. And before you even, before <laughs> we knew that it was Tom Petty coming in, I was already on Google typing in Tom Petty and Stratocaster and what popped up was him playing a cream colored Stratocaster which is what Prince was saying. Cool. Yeah, cool. <laughs> wow, that's beautiful how this works. That's great. Awesome. All right, now I'm going to just have private conversation with my friend and my husband. So thanks for watching the follow up to the transformative channel with Prince and Tom Petty and with the guitar.